Hello and a warm welcome from the English West Midlands. We find ourselves at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Liverpool. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. The initial 11 for Wolves. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson begins in goal. Trent Alexander-Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Thank you for attending today's game at the Millennium Stadium. Enjoy the match. And the game begins. Nunes. Wolves might be able to cash in from here. Diego Costa. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Options in the centre. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, Mo Salah knows how to light up any game, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. Well, Derek, over the years, he scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace. When the ball's played in behind, nobody catches him and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper and we know what the result is. Huang Hee-chan on attacking possibilities. Martinho, that's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Well, that's the end of that move for now. Darwin Nunez. It's with Fabinho. Andrew Robertson. Thiago. Gakpo. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Gakpo. Here is Thiago. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. <laughs> well, they fancy a short one. Salah. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. And Salah always has the sizzle. His goal. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. Liverpool 
So the action continues, and it's on Wolves to show invention and perhaps level the game. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Opportunity! Oh, good work by the keeper. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not all that convincing defensively. Van Dijk. And he stopped them in their tracks. He's going forward well here. He's in with a chance. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Short corner it is. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. So as we move towards the half-time interval, it's Wolves chasing the game here. Stuart, how would you assess what you've seen from them in this half? Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they have... Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. Now sending it in. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. And Moutinho with it. Now Diego Costa. The ball with Podence. It could be up for grabs. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. No more time left. That will conclude the first half here at Molyneux. Well, no wonder the focus is on Mohamed Salah because that was a terrific first-half display. Stuart, I know you enjoyed it very much. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Well, underway again. Advantage Liverpool after the first 45, but a long way from being settled. A really effective shielding under pressure, but just like that, possession changes hands. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Gakpo Nunez This attack looks highly promising And Thiago Great block Moutinho And a fine tackle and The pass could do damage It's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, here's the replay. Just look at this pass from Salah. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal.
So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Can he find the right pass? Huang He Chan. The players waiting in the centre and reading it absolutely superbly. Nunez. And Thiago. Can he put it away? Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Huang He Chan. Mateus Nunes. This is Diego Costa. Offside, a tight one. And the substitution will occur now. Is it going to be? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And they get the ball rolling again. It does appear that Liverpool are just about out of sight. Sana. Oh, a nice looking pass, and he's in the clear. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, just watch this again. Salah's pass is inch perfect, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4 0. Please return to your vehicle. Your lights are on. Podence. Mateus Nunes. And Martinho with it. Costa. He had to react and did. Neves counter attacking very much an option all hands on deck well it was a good counter attack in the making but very alert defending well not far away from full time Stuart and could it be Wolves have left themselves too much to do well, this is certainly a performance to forget because they've been totally outplayed today. How many times have they been opened up during this game? They have to defend better than this. It's been a dismal display. Well played in from the flank, but not to any great effect. Thiago. Beautifully disguised ball. He just needs to keep a cool head. Tremendously strong in the tackle. So the referee brings this match to an end. The final whistle is sounded and far from the ideal scoreline from the Wolves' point of view. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.